The Mariana Trench, located in the western Pacific Ocean, is the deepest known part of Earth's oceans, stretching over 1,550 miles, 2,500 kilometers, long and 45 miles, 70 kilometers wide. The trench reaches nearly 36,000 feet, 11,000 meters, at its lowest point, known as Challenger Deep, deeper than Mount Everest is tall. Despite being the deepest part of the Earth, the trench remains largely unexplored due to its harsh environment, extreme pressure, freezing temperatures, and total darkness. The Mariana Trench lies at a subduction zone where two tectonic plates, the Pacific Plate and the Mariana Plate, converge. The Pacific Plate is being forced beneath the Mariana Plate in a slow but steady process that has formed the trench over millions of years. This ongoing subduction also creates significant geological activity, including underwater earthquakes and volcanic activity. As the Pacific Plate sinks deeper into the Earth's mantle, it generates mud volcanoes and hydrothermal vents along the trench floor, releasing superheated, mineral-rich fluids into the ocean. These hydrothermal vents are a critical part of the trench's unique ecosystem. The superheated water spewing from the vents creates a chemical-rich environment, which supports chemosynthetic organisms that rely on chemicals rather than sunlight for energy. This chemosynthesis provides the foundation for a complex ecosystem that includes a variety of deep-sea creatures, many of which are specially adapted to survive in the harsh conditions of the trench. Among these creatures are tube worms, crabs, and various types of fish that thrive near the hydrothermal vents. Life in the Mariana Trench exists under extraordinary conditions. The pressure at the bottom of the trench is over 1,000 times greater than at sea level. For context, the pressure at Challenger Deep is equivalent to the weight of about 50 jumbo jets pressing down on a person. Despite this crushing pressure, a variety of unusual organisms have evolved to survive in the trench. These include xenophyophores, giant single-celled organisms that thrive in the deep ocean, and snailfish, which have gelatinous bodies that allow them to withstand the extreme pressure. Another remarkable adaptation of trench-dwelling organisms is bioluminescence. Many creatures that live in the deep ocean, where sunlight cannot reach, have evolved to produce their own light through chemical reactions. This bioluminescence serves various purposes, including attracting prey, deterring predators, and communicating with other members of their species. Some species of fish, jellyfish, and squid use bioluminescence to survive in the complete darkness of the deep ocean, giving the trench an otherworldly appearance. Exploring the Mariana Trench has always been a significant challenge due to the extreme conditions. The first manned mission to the bottom of the trench was accomplished in 1960 by U.S. Navy Lieutenant Don Walsh and Swiss oceanographer Jacques Picard. They descended to the Challenger Deep in the Bathyscaf Trieste, a submersible vessel designed to withstand the immense pressures at such depths. Their historic dive took nearly five hours to reach the bottom, but they only spent a short time there before returning to the surface. In 2012, Filmmaker and explorer James Cameron made a solo dive to the bottom of Challenger Deep in a specially designed submersible called Deep Sea Challenger. His expedition was equipped with cameras and scientific instruments, which allowed him to capture the first high-definition footage of the trench's floor. Cameron's dive also collected valuable data that has helped scientists better understand the trench's geological features and marine life. While these missions have provided important insights, much of the trench remains unexplored due to the difficulties involved in deep-sea exploration. In recent years, advancements in technology have enabled scientists to explore the Mariana Trench using remotely operated vehicles, ROVs, and autonomous underwater vehicles, AUVs. These unmanned systems can dive to extreme depths and are equipped with cameras and sampling tools to study the trench's unique ecosystems and geological processes. 
ROVs and AUVs have allowed researchers to explore previously inaccessible areas of the trench, gathering important data about the organisms and geological features that exist in the depths. One of the most surprising findings in recent years has been the discovery of human-made pollutants in the deepest parts of the trench. Scientists have found traces of microplastics and toxic chemicals, such as polychlorinated biphenyls, PCBs, even at the bottom of Challenger Deep. This discovery highlights the extent to which human activity has impacted even the most remote parts of the planet. The presence of pollutants in the trench raises concerns about the long-term health of deep-sea ecosystems and underscores the pervasive nature of pollution in our oceans. Despite the challenges of exploration, scientists believe the Mariana Trench holds vital clues about Earth's history and the origins of life. Some researchers suggest that life on Earth may have originated in environments similar to those found in the trench, where chemical reactions at hydrothermal vents could have provided the necessary conditions for the development of early life forms. Studying the trenches' ecosystems could provide new insights into how life can survive in extreme environments, which may also have implications for the search for life on other planets and moons with similar conditions. Understanding the geological processes that occur in the Mariana Trench is also important for predicting seismic activity and understanding the mechanics of earthquakes and tsunamis. The subduction zone at the trench is responsible for some of the most powerful earthquakes and tsunamis in history. By studying the geological activity in the trench, scientists hope to gain a better understanding of these natural disasters and improve methods for predicting and preparing for future seismic events. The Mariana Trench remains one of the most fascinating and least understood places on Earth. Its extreme environment presents unique challenges to exploration, but it also offers a glimpse into the limits of life and the inner workings of our planet. As technology continues to advance, future expeditions to the trench will likely reveal more of its secrets, unlocking new knowledge about the Earth's geology, ecosystems, and the potential for life in extreme environments. From the discovery of strange deep-sea creatures to revelations about the Earth's geological processes, the Mariana Trench continues to captivate scientists and explorers alike. As one of the last great unexplored regions on our planet, it holds the potential for groundbreaking discoveries that could change our understanding of the natural world. With each new mission, we come closer to unlocking the mysteries hidden beneath the ocean's depths and uncovering the secrets of this extraordinary environment.